today is going to be a review day. We're going to do an unboxing. So, the point of today's video is we are going to talk about eyelashes and falsies and look at new methods that have come out for applying falsies. Here we go. Ooh, that's a handsome looking box, huh? Okay, so this is something that I did see online and just had to try and wanted to do the first ever trial online. So the packaging for this is actually very, very cool. Kudos to that company. Um, I will, this is not sponsored, but I will put in the box down below information on how to get this. Here's how it comes packaged. I don't know if anyone has ever tried this before. So this is by Flirt. This is what I would lovingly refer to as an eyelash staple gun. Um, eyelashes are pretty fun, um, but if there's an easy way to put them on, I'm all for it. So here's what this looks like. It looks simple, right? There's Okay, five steps. First step, roll for the first time. Flashes need to be primed. Rolled forward a few times until lashes begin to appear. We can roll. Can you hear that? So, I kid you not, this comes loaded with the fake lashes. Okay. So, there's a little dot in the middle there where a line rolls up, and that is what we have aligned. Step two, lock. When the lash is exposed halfway, press the top button to click close and hold lashes in place. Hmm, okay, so I do not see any lashes yet. I have to keep rolling. Oh, I can see them, they're coming. Okay, so we're gonna roll the red line into the target because you know whenever you're putting something on your eye you should prime it like it's a target okay can everyone see that those little three buds those are our lashes okay when it is supposed halfway press the top button to click close our top button right here we're gonna click that closed kind of clicking it closed Click it up. Oh, here to click. Okay. Glue. Brush a thin lash, thin layer of lash adhesive evenly on the end of the lash buds. So this lets you use your favorite glue, which is good because my favorite is the brand Duo. And I've got it in black today. Sadly, my least favorite is the ever affordable Elf. This doesn't do anything, it leaves them on for a few seconds. So we're gonna brush our lash glue on it. It's actually kinda of nice having it primed and I don't have to hold it. Put some lash glue right on it. And it says to be careful not to get it on the applicator. So we will not be getting it on the applicator. And the little strip between the two is clear so I can see when I've got my black glue on it. Okay, so as you know, never ever put it on while it's wet. You want to wait 20 to 30 seconds for lash glue to dry. So we'll blow on it. Give it time to dry. While it's drying, the next step we're going to do is apply the lashes gently, touching the ends of the lashes to your lash line. For perfect placement, stretch the upper eyelid by gently pulling the skin taut at the outer corner. Holds false lashes in place for three to five seconds. Then we're going to press this bottom button and it's going to release the lashes onto my eyes. So my eyes are all done right now. And I've done silver violet and onyx and also some snow on my eyes today. And then they are lined with lash extend. They're not even with eyeliner today. It looks quite good for not being a true eyeliner. It's been long enough. That's been tacky. Let's see if we can pull this off.
Okay, we're going to count to five. One, two, three, four, five. Um, I don't think that's quite what we're going for. <laughs> See if we can position those while they're still tacky. You know, it's actually not bad at all. Surprisingly, I still have my eyes intact and it's adding quite a bit. So let's continue and see what we can do here. So here comes, once it started, the lashes are all primed. We're gonna take a moment and get our duo glue on it. So we're gonna continue with one eye first. Now, my absolute favorite thing to do is get eyelash extensions put on. And my friend Haley does those phenomenally. I love the lashes she does. But if I just need something for a day and I don't have my extensions on, I can see this working. So we're gonna go inward for this one. Oh, we gave enough time dry, let's check. It's tacky. We're gonna lock it. Going to place it next to the other lash, right on top of where it's lined. Hold it in place, five seconds. And release the staple gun. Same problem, where it goes up. It's like it shoots out of the thing, ready to curl upwards. But I do think it's manageable. Yeah. This is not as weird as I thought it would be. You see, right, left, right, let's do one. It's not bad at all. Let's do one more up on the high part, and then we'll stick three of them on the other side. Let it dry, let it dry. So, this is Flirt. It's called their Lash Applicator, and it comes completely loaded. Are you tacky? You are tacky. Okay, ready to go. Lining it up. Holding it in place. Hitting the trigger. It does have the desire to shoot straight up, but because it's tacky, it is adjustable. Yeah. Okay, can we see the difference in the eyelashes? So we're gonna complete the difference between our first eye that we just did three on and the undone one. Huh? I must say, it doesn't, it's not uncomfortable because it goes on in those buds. So I have the whole lip line, I'm not getting the lift on the edges really like it. Okay, let's hurry and we'll finish up the other side and see what our complete look looks like. Okay, we're going to touch it up. What I'm putting on is actually one of the products I've had for about a week now and I've been trying out. So this, if you can see the little label, is Lash Extend. Good glare has gotten you. There we go. Now Lash Extend comes in black and it comes in clear. Um, the clear you can easily just put on at night or during the day if you don't want to have eyeliner. But I use this as my eyeliner. And what it does is it provides the nutrition your lashes need and the moisture to help them grow. And as you can see, it has a very fine tip edge. So it too can be successful at growing your lashes and working with you to get the perfect um, wing. So if you want the perfect wing, it's fine enough. Same rule applies. Blow on it, let it dry for a few moments before you go to your eye with it. We're just following what I've done earlier today because where my duo glue is in black, it can make the lash line appear messy.
but I prefer the black glue to the clear glue, which is just me. Okay, there they are, artificial lashes. We got six clicks with the lash gun, so I'm going to say that I actually really like this product. Um, it works with in conjunction with all my already makeup and the glue that I liked. Um, so this came to $28 and they sent me some cute flirt emoji stickers too. So bottom line is I actually really love this product. I think it's probably one of the easiest ways I've ever applied lashes. So if you are into falsies and you're used to gluing them on, I highly recommend this.